Hey, how's it going YouTube? So, coming at you again for another tip of the day. And today I want to talk about windshield wipers and kind of what can cause problems with those and how you can check them to make sure that you pass inspection and so that you can make sure that they're working properly. So we've all been there. You go and get your inspection done and you end up failing because you haven't looked at these in forever and it hasn't rained in forever, so you haven't used them. This happens a lot, especially down here in Texas, maybe not up in somewhere like Seattle where it rains all the time. But down in Texas, we get this problem a lot. And so what you need to do is actually just come in and do a visual inspection of these wiper blades, preferably every six months, and then you're gonna wanna change them at least every year. And what you're gonna look for is you're just gonna wanna look at this rubber on here and check it out to make sure that it's all still one piece and that there's no cracks or any kind of splits or separations. And then you're gonna to wanna to feel it, kind of move it back and forth and make sure that it's not hardened and stiff. Make sure that it's not separating from this frame. You're also gonna to wanna to check along the wiper arm here and make sure that it's not bent, that it's got a good shape to it. And you wanna check um, this arm as well, make sure it's not bent and you want to make sure that you're getting contact all along the squeegee here. You also want to check here and make sure that you've got a nice square edge and not something that's rounded from use. Also, you just need to listen every time you use these and make sure that there's not any kind of noise happening like a chatter or a squeak or, you know, anything like that. They don't need to be making noise when they when they're operating properly. And also make sure that they're not, you know, skipping around and uh, anything like that. And then check also, you know, just on your windshield as you use them, because if they're streaking or anything like that, it could be a sign of cracks or splits in this rubber squeegee, or it could also mean debris and stuff has accumulated on either the blade or the glass. So that's all things to look out for. One thing I like to do for some kind of preventative maintenance is just to take a cotton ball and some isopropyl alcohol and you'll just wet this down and then just kind of run it along that squeegee edge just kind of lift up on here and you'll just run it down that blade and clean it and that'll get like oil and road tar and bugs and dirt and all that kind of stuff off there so they'll be more likely to stay clean and stay healthier longer so that's kind of today's tip of the day just uh you know some preventative wiper maintenance just to make sure you pass inspection because it's annoying to have to pay those guys the inflated price of the convenience of buying wipers from them just so you pass inspection. So you can just do these things that I mentioned in the video and uh, you know keep them right as rain. Get it? Wipers, right as rain. Anyway, that's today's tip of the day. Yeah, so y'all get out there and clean your wipers up. Make sure you know they're working properly. Happy wrenching, guys.